I don't have time on this Friday night Been sleeping with two eyes open Looking for you For you The kind of girl who won't apologize Something cool in her oceans Washes over you Over you And I'm just trying to catch her eyes The blue jeans don't fit quite right Hi everybody! And today I will show you how to crochet amazing project with beads. For this project you can use any kinds of beads. It depends whatever you want. This is my own project. I created it recently. For this project I am using 2 mm crochet hook, a ball of yarn, all additional information about the tools. Could be found in the description below the video. Please join me and today you will see how to crochet cute hearts that consist of only three rounds. Here how they look like and I remind you I created them recently so this is my own project. So in this video you will see how to crochet such simple heart step by step. For this one I used 5 beads plus 1 bead I added to the center of the flower. You can stop at any stage of this project. Also I will tell you how to crochet such kind of heart but without beads. So in such case instead of single crochet with bead you should crochet, double crochet, and instead of double crochet with bead, you should make treble crochet. And for additional, you can do the cord for this heart. You should choose the length of this small piece of cord. It can be longer or shorter, it depends what project you would like to have. Please join me. It will be very interesting and let's get started. Let's crochet the cute heart. Make a chain of four. One, two, three and four. And join the chain in the round by making a slip stitch into the first chain stitch. The foundation ring is a ring. Make 8 single crochet into this ring. Make a chain. I will not use this chain. Make 8 single crochet. 1. And while making these stitches, I will remove all yarn. 2. 3. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. And to complete this round, and I skip the chain stitch, insert the hook into the first single crochet, make a seam, make a slip stitch. Then I turn the work to the back side. You can use the sewing needle to remove the long piece of yarn and I continue working on my heart. I did the first round. Let's crochet round two. In total it should be three rounds in my heart. Let's crochet round two. Make a chain. Make single crochet into the same stitch that I completed the previous round into. Make single crochet through the next stitch, then chain of 5 for the chain space. Then I'm joining a bead. Take a bead, 
put it in the hook, insert the hook into the next stitch, take the working yarn, pull it through, and pull through the bead. And make single crochet. My bead is joined. This is the back side. Continue working. Make a chain of two for the chain space. At this point, I'm joining a bead. Take a bead, put it on the hook. Well, insert the hook into the next stitch, take the working yarn, pull it through and make single crochet. Chain of three for the chain space. Yarn over the hook, take a bead, put it on the hook, Make double crochet with bead. Insert the hook into the next stitch, pull up a loop, pull through the bead, pull through two loops, and pull through two loops. My double crochet is ready. Make chain of three for the chain space. Take a bit, put it on the hook and make single crochet through the next stitch. Insert the hook into the next stitch, pull up a loop, pull through the bead and pull through two loops. My single crochet is ready. Then chain of two and take a bit. Put it on the hook. Then insert the hook into the next stitch. Pull up a loop, pull through the bead and pull through two loops. Let's complete this round. Make a chain of five. For the chain space, I skip. Sorry, I don't skip any stitches. Make single crochet into the next stitch. I skip the chain stitch. Insert the hook into the single crochet. Make it slip stitch. My round is ready. It was round two. So my round two is ready. Let's stop at this point and let's look at the ready example. In this case I did this heart without beads. Instead of single crochet with bead, I did just double crochet. And here, instead of double crochet with bead, I'm done treble crochet. You can use such kind of thing if you don't like beads. It could be perfect for keychain or earring. Or pedant. So I continue working on my current heart. At this point, I join it five beads only. Next time, I will show you how to crochet round three. Let's crochet round three, chain of two, work into the chain space, yarn over the hook. Make five double crochet with pico. One, 
and pickle, chain of three and work with the slip stitch. Chain and double crochet, then chain of three for the pico and work with a slip stitch into two loops of the double crochet. Double crochet three. chain and double crochet and pico chain and make the fifth one chain of three and work with a slip stitch chain Make double crochet into the next chain space and chain of three for the pickle. Chain. Make two double crochet with pico into the next chain space. One. Chain and make the second. Double crochet with pico. Chain. And let's stop and look. I am done the first side of the heart. Here what I have at this point. Now I continue working on the second side. After I have done the chain, yarn over the hook, insert the hook into the stitch, make double crochet, chain of three for the pico, and work with the slip stitch, and make a pico on the chain. Then chain, then chain of three more. Insert the hook into the fourth chain stitch away from the hook, make a slip stitch. My pico is ready. Make double crochet into the same stitch. And make a pico made of three chains. chain let's stop and look continue working with the opposite side you should crochet in the same way as i showed you before yarn over the hook and make double crochet and pico one chain Two, two. I'm done two double crochet with picos. Then work with the next chain space. Make double crochet, make five double crochet with pico one, two. I will make them faster than usually. Three. Four, chain and five.
I straight up my stitches. Then chain of two for the chain space one, two. Insert the hook. This is my slip stitch. And insert the hook into the single crochet of the previous round and make a slip stitch. My heart is ready. My heart is almost done. Next time I will show you how to crochet the cord for this motif and how to decorate the center of this heart. You can crochet the cord longer or shorter, it depends whatever you want. You should determine it by yourself. This is the second example. In this case I did the knot. Or you can cut off the yarn and stop at this stage and you will get amazing heart. And now I show you how to crochet the cord for this heart. Make a chain 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. You can count any amount of chains. Insert the hook into the first chain stitch. Make a slip stitch and you can cut off the yarn. Then I am going to remove all yarns along the stitches or through the stitches and add a bit to the center of the heart. Here how it looks in the ready project. And my heart will be ready. So my heart is done. Here how they look like. As you can see, two examples of these three I made of with beads. And another one I just used crochet hook and a ball of yarn. My heart consists of only three rounds. It can be perfect to create jewelry such as earring, pedant or keychain. Also it could be part of big project. And also I remind you, you can remove the cord for this heart and it looks beautiful and simple at the same time. Don't forget to subscribe to my page or channel, follow me in social media and of course crochet with me and learn more. Good luck in crafting. See you in the next see you in the next video tutorial. Stay safe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.